We were back at the hideaway. Also, we did bad. Odin split the sea in two. She's always been partial to a tall tale. And unfortunately, and then there's tall. And unfortunately, it's true. I to it myself. I see your uncle isn't with you. He stayed with the Enterprise. After our brush with the Einherjer, she was in urgent need of repair. And my uncle knows a shipwright in Randalar. We're to join him there when we're ready to sell for ash. Okay. You sure that's wise? No. Last I heard, the place was still overrun with a Kashyyyk. Everywhere is overrun with... True. Thank you. Ultima's plague is spreading. We're running out of time, aren't we? We've done our best to shore up that hideaway. I doubt a few planks will stop what's coming. Still, we'll keep at it. Every little helps, I suppose. Every little Let's helps. Hope so. And you pack your back pockets across the narrow. Ooh. Oh, yes. I, I was like, what's this? And then I was like, yes, a new icon. Clive has claimed a portion of the icon Shiva's essence. The tuna with Shiva not only changes the elemental aspect of Clive's magic spells, but also allows access to several new iconic abilities, such as Ice Age, which forcefully knocks back enemies at great distances. Abilities are found on the Abilities tab in the main menu. Shiva's feet, iconic feet, cold snap can be used to swiftly move left, right, forward and back to dodge attacks or close in on an enemy. That looks useful. I should visit Joshua. Assuming Tai will allow it. Um, maybe. Can I leave the area? I can. Oh, we've got a lot of stuff. Okay. Um. August. Are you over there asking for a, uh, a side quest? Is that another bloody Blackthorn side quest? Is our goddamn blacksmith once again goddamn blue? Because he was blue like half an hour ago when we fixed him. Why is he like this? Otto, why is he like this? Oh, God damn it! Okay. Let's talk to Goot first. How are you doing? How are you doing? Quick look. Uh, under new management. I don't want to travel to these places yet, though. Rekindling the Flame, part two. And, oh, Darmaki have quite a few. We've got lines in the sand, trading places, and duty and dying. So we've got five in the outside area. Always and we've something got in there. At least two here. One, two, Three here. Okay, okay. Let's start with goddamn August. Hi August, can this be something completely not related to our boy? Heard the bad news then, did you? What bad news? What bad news? About Dravosh. Blackthorn's old horn. Oh fuck, with what happened to that? the Dravosh? Well, anyway, the mines just down the road from there are spewing out ether like fuck. no one's business. Okay, that's the understandable. Village. Safe from the flood for now, but they've got other problems. We better go help Every them. Every creature then. in the area is either turned okay, that's or on the way to turning. Apparently, Zoltan and the others are living on borrowed time. They need help and quick. Dorish sent a few curse breakers to keep an eye on things, but there's only so much a couple of scouts can do. Except get eaten. If something ain't done soon, yeah, we'll definitely go overrun. help. Yeah, we have to help. I won't let that happen. Didn't think you would. Does Blackthorn know? I thought it might be better if he didn't. I think you should tell him stupid. anyway. He will find out. I reckon we should tell him. Yes. No. It's better this way. He's probably keeping yes. eyes and well, ears on the town. I can't stand about knowing what's happening out there, so I'm off. I'll see you in Dravosht. Okay. I'm not going to prioritise anything quite yet. I don't know what I want to do and what I don't want to do. But at least we don't have to go talk to him and then talk to somebody else and then all of that business. Okay, I went to Blackthorn and I got a nice new sword. It doesn't look at any different to what I'm wearing. I mean, it does actually. I'm on the wrong thing. 
So yeah, we got because we got Shiva, we got the new weapon. Oh, yep, Shiva channel. Congratulations to us. Can we can we move on? Oh, I got some abilities. We better show that. So yeah, we got Ice Brand. Do I get to see it? Not really. But yeah. Perfect. Let's see who is right into us. Uh, a healer's place. Thank you for helping me guide my mentor free from his mortal coil. Contrary to what the maddening, maddening cloud believes, we physicers are not without our limits. I cannot hope to cure every ill, mend every wound, save every life. The only medicine that will see you home safe without fail is prevention. Not that this knowledge will ever stop any of you from chasing down some behemoth for its toenails. And then Captain Doris. Sir, I and the other curse breakers have grown concerned regarding the well-being of our captain. Despite the apparent unrest, her recent investigations have visited upon her. Lady Doris refuses all offers of assistance. If it is not too much trouble, I would ask that you please speak with the captain and learn what learn what troubles her so deeply. Okay. There's no way of knowing if Doris will confide in me, but I can speak to her at least. Yes, you can. Self determination. And then. Okay, she's over there, is she? So I guess we'll head back that way and then head up there for even weirder sciences. Doris? Is she here somewhere? Doesn't look like she's here. Where are you? Can I help you, Sid? I'm looking for Doris. I'm looking for Doris. Is she here? I'm afraid not. She's at Martha's rest on a job. Of course she is. My job, actually. When she heard what the mission was, she insisted on going herself. Alone. Why? Did she? What was the mission? Following up on some new information. About? Once they'd settled in, the bearers you helped liberate in the Dragon's Airy were keen to talk about their imprisonment and about their captor. Oh, you think the Doris might know? The slaver caused tracking when they were attacked by the Beastmen. I'll go and find her. She's at Martha's rest, you say? Okay. If she's not moved on already, yeah. I hope everything's all right. Me too. Why would Doris insist on going alone? Maybe Cole was right to be worried. Maybe. Let's uh, avoid that area for now. Uh, where are we going? Are we going into uh, Mid's dungeon? Kind of looks like Mid's dungeon. Is she in the dungeon now or did she go to thingy with that uncle? How was she? Not. Could the Enterprise any it was amazing. With Canva in the hands of Akashic. Hi, Wayne. Ah, Sid. <laughs> Just the man I was hoping to see. D did you have a moment? Do you have to say it like that? Don't tell me. You need more bomb ash. Oh, no. We still got plenty of that left. What I'm do you need? I'm bringing another one of the Chief's designs to life. This time, it's a new smelter. Ah. It's got a reverberatory hood over the top. For additional thermo amplification and a system of reciprocal recirculatory regenerators that that um excuse me let's just say it gets very blimmin hot a, a heck of a lot hotter than anything blackthorn's got in his forge that's for certain only mythical engines get hotter and you can't chuck ore in one um. of them and get metal out the other end <laughs> okay trouble is we won't be able to make out of any old rubbish neither we need Nevo. the good stuff. And I hear you once helped Helena get her hands on exactly that. What's that? Any chance she could help me too? What do you need? Specifically. If it's for the good of the hideaway, I'd be happy to. Oh, it is. I promise you. So, what exactly is this good stuff you need me to find? Got a couple of examples here. Spherical echoes. Spherical echoes. Or fallen materials. 
So this smelter is similar to the Mithril engine in more ways than one. That's right. That's right. Sorry, I need to stop making fun of him. I feel a little bad about doing that. Nothing else, see? And what's more, they're directional, transferring heat from the inside to the outside. But these things, they're all outside. If we line the hub with them, they'll reflect the heat right back into the furnace. Okay. We've collected as many as we can, and I know where we can get the rest. Trouble is, they're all watched in <coughs> by their bigger and bigger cousins. So you want me to visit some ruins, destroy some Sorry about that, I just bring back the spheres they're choked on my own slide or tongue. Yeah. But that was fun. Short mind, and we know exactly where they are. There's one up Amber Way. You just in told me that. that. They call Lost Plume. And another in the Silent South over in Dalmechia. Last one is in the ruins of Advent. It is in okay. the Empire. Okay, so we've got three All of them right to then. go for. Wish me luck. Will do. I'll be keeping all my fingers and toes crossed. Yeah, you do that. <laughs> Even weirder science. Cool. I mean, that's actually pretty useful. Didn't that upgrade my potions? I feel that it did. <laughs> anyway. <clears throat> Let's uh, go out to do these, and I think we've got some in the areas as well. It's weird that I can see that in the distance. Anyway, I thought we'd go to Martha's rest. Oh, it first. should be somewhere nearby. Assuming she's still here. She has to be. We'll talk to Doris and then do whatever we need to. Um. So I saw the green. I should have probably picked that one up first. Got greens of all shapes looking for shelter, and sizes. are you? Colors no. I'm looking for Doris. At least I've oh, talked to you. Don't really need that, but I'll take Much it. Because I'm here. Down here, maybe? I keep seeing you. It doesn't still hurt, does it? It's been a pleasure, Doris. Just like old times. I'll give your offer some thought, my lady. How goes the investigation? Sid, what brings you to Martha's Rest? You. I mean, I not heard you just were out here on you. your own tracking our slaver. I trust you're being careful. Of course. And it had to be me. The bearers from the Dragon's Airy confirmed a long-held suspicion of mine that the slaver we've been tracking is an old acquaintance. So you decided to go all on your She's own? She's no fool. If we'd come in force, she would have spotted us straight away and then vanished without a trace. That was her just now, wasn't it? So, was it a fruitful reunion? I'd say so. She tried to recruit me. Seems her time in Rosaria is coming to an end. She's abducted bearers from across the region and is looking to smuggle them back into Sambrek. Cool. After her brush with those beast men on the road to Northreach, she hired herself an Imperial escort. Which she wants me to join. She's dangerous, Sid. But I think I can stop her. Then I'm going with you. I'll take care of the escort. You can see the bearers to safety. Where are they? The Balm Arches, soon to break camp. You go on ahead. I'll follow once I've sent word back to the hideaway. Okay. Sounds like a plan. I don't like that I can see every single thing here. It's really annoying me. <laughs> Let's see what I assume Martha wants for us. Yep, there she is. Martha, what do you need? Clive, I was just about to send for well, you. Well, I was here anyway. I'd like you to take something to Sir Wade up in Eastpool. Seeds for planting. Thought it was about time they started growing their own food. Well, that's nice of you. I'll keep providing them with whatever they need in the meantime, of course. But if Eastpool's going to survive, it's got to be able to fend for itself. As of those poor bearers. They've lived their whole lives in servitude, but now they're their own masters. Small wonder they ain't got the foggiest how to provide for themselves. So it's up to us to teach them. 
And if you're wondering why you, well, the Wagoneers taking supplies up that way have been coming back with more and more reports of Akashic around the village of late. So Wade's putting a brave face on it. But I think even he's starting to worry. And if he's likely to share those concerns okay. with anyone, it's you. Let's go do it then. All right. All right. Thanks. Wouldn't ask if I didn't have to. There. That should be enough to keep him in Gizal Greens for a few years at least. Gizal Greens, huh? Gizal Greens. Not the most mouth-watering crop, I'll admit. But they're hardy, they grow fast, and they fill a hole. Better that than something that'll wither away at first frost. And chocobos love them too, which is no small thing. When I say all of us need to pull together to get East Pool back on its feet, I mean all of us. Yeah, all of us. exactly succulent, but cook them right, and they're just about bearable. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> anyway, Sir Wade'll know what to do with them. And if he don't, well... I'll go up there and show him myself. I'm sure you will. Let's hope that that's not necessary, huh? Let's prioritise that one because it's in the area. Well, what else is in the area? We've got that one up in Eastpool. We've got that one. And we've got even weirder signs, which I also want to prioritise. So let's get them. Rid of you and pop you on. Okay. So I say we do these bottom two first. We can come across and then go around and then we can teleport up to East Pool. Sounds like a plan. Uh, yeah. This seems right. I just got a bit turned around, that's all. Let me just double check. Yes, yes, yes. So how do I get up there? Do I just get up or... Go away, please. I don't want to fight you today. There we go. Faster. Can I just go this way? Yeah, and then up the hill. I see. Shelf rock. So this is the bow marchers, right? Anybody here? Good. They haven't broken camp yet. How did Doris come to know a slaver, I wonder? Well, it's either her We've slaver, right? Enough. She's not coming. Ready the bearers. We're leaving. Back to civilization, is it, Mom? With all haste. Lest any of you lackwits start talking like these feckless bumpkins. I presume your men are ready. We've suffered too many delays as it is. Any more, and I'll be docking your. Oh, pay. I hate to be the bearer of bad news. Yes, oh, but before you go, it appears we have company. Kill him. Okay. You're welcome to try. You are very welcome to try. Let's bring our new girl up. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was beautiful. Oh, I see you. Mother! 
He's pissing me off. Now where's this motherfucker that I'm gonna face now? It's not you, it's not you. There you are. Don't even think about it. I didn't see what she was. Let's see. Okay, we've got a bit of movement there, that's good. He doesn't like to use any other. Why are these guys so powerful? Oh, I'm sorry, boy. I didn't realize that you were facing one of them. We'll get him together. Voila. That took a while. That goddamn, like, protect. It was pissing me off. I should have just used, the, like, an, a big, powerful fighting thing. Should have used Flames of Rebirth. So much for your escort. <laughs> You'll forgive me for not avenging my men. I'm not the swordswoman I used to be. I surrender. Do with me as you wish, Sid the Outlaw. You know Sid. who I am then, huh? Ah, Doris. I take it you're not here to rescue me from our brooding renegade? Nope. You know, I always wondered where you'd vanished to, but casting your lot with this criminal of all people. Better fighting for a cause than killing for coin. I'm sorry, Sid. I should have I told mean, you sooner. As long as you're on our side now. This woman, my former master, once trained bearer children to be weapons in service of the highest bidder. She raised me like a daughter. And I did terrible things to earn her favor. It wasn't all terrible, surely. We had our fun, too. She seems a little bit hurt always at so that. always so eager to learn and had such clever hands. All my other children took either to the blade or to the books. Always either or. But you proved yourself a master of both. Mm. That's why I kept you for yeah. my own. <clears throat> How about it, my little dagger? Care to swear that blade to Do you really again? think that's going to work? I never swore my blade to you, nor will I ever. I fight for a higher cause, to liberate the bearers of this world. Farewell, master. Thank you for making me the weapon I am. You always were a righteous child. Perhaps that's the reason I loved you so. Okay, she won that conversation. Now Doris is going to be thinking about that for a while. What do you want to do with her? I am not the killer she wanted me to be. Not anymore. And she no longer has friends in high places. 
The dame does, though. Her connections at the Imperial Court will see that justice is done. I mean, will it? You're right. If you're certain. I am. And thank you. For everything. Now, I better let these bearers know that they're safe. And I should head back to the hideaway and put Cole's mind at ease. You should. But first, we finish what was here, right? No, why are we? Oh, my God. I was Alexa, not finished in that area. Doris's message just arrived. I hear you saved more bearers from being smuggled across the border. Yes. With any luck, they'll be joining us in the hideaway shortly. Oh, and Muleta. We don't need to worry about Doris anymore. I'd been hoping as much. She mentioned one or two things in her report. So the slaver we'd been chasing all these months was her former master. <laughs> Wish I'd known. She's been arrested, by the way, over in Sambrek. Went quietly, or so we're told. But she won't be getting off lightly. The Empire may have no love for bearers, but it's none too fond of Okay, so I guess either. she is going to get punished. Can't have been easy for Doris. I'm sure it wasn't. But don't worry. She'll be all right. Why is this the so. one quest you where we it. had to like go back to the hideaway to straight away you came here or so i understand anyway thanks again sid that's annoying the curse breakers would be lost without doris and <sighs> you of course of course the good work Cole. quest complete yay now I need to head all the way back there. Lovely. Too many rocks here. Oh, creepy ass fallen book. Can I get down? You deserve a rest. There we go. Go away. Bomb, huh? It doesn't have quite the distance that the Phoenix does, but I am pretty pleased with um, Shiva. Fun. Right, so we have to. Okay, so it's either or, is it? We'll kick that open. I like how it has a hand as if saying, do you want to open this? And then you're like, yes. And so it's like, yes, kick it open then. Here somewhere. I'm looking for balls. Are there balls here? We need to deal with these ones first. Ow. Nice. Uh, Fine, we'll focus on these first. Uh, really burn this thing off. upgraded some of my previous abilities, especially in Phoenix and Titan, because I keep using them so much. And hopefully they hit a bit harder. Make it less, you know, so quick. Okay, that definitely finished weirdly at the end. Here. 
<laughs> that, uh, I, that's my favourite move. It's really weird that that's my favourite, but it is. That's like all I've got, just attacking. Get a bit of wool of white. We get a bit of extra damage. Could use them, but we'll pass them. And that will be this. This is it. Yay. Right then. There's too much to find. But she's not in this area. We've got to go talk to Wade. Talk to our good boy. Our good boy, Wade. Okay, so we need to see what they need, don't we? Wade, what do you want? What do you need, my boy? Ah, I say Lord to the Rossfield. man that's like five years older than me. What brings you to Eastpool? A delivery from Martha. Get your green seeds. Enjoy. Yeah, this place is not a happy looking place These anymore. These are green seeds. Martha's keen to cut the apron strings then, is she? I jest, of course. You see, I had thought we might be able to revive the old wheat fields. But they'd long since gone to seed. Only without the seeds. What does that mean? Martha was hoping you might be able to show the bearers how to plant and tend these. So that they'll be able to fend for themselves. That's not a bad idea. These bearers had only recently escaped their bonds before we brought them here. So they're not used to being themselves. They know little of freedom. Of providing for themselves and their loved ones. Unless we teach them how to live like free men. I fear that all we have achieved in bringing them here is to exchange one master for another. Not that myself and the Guardians have been the best example to them so far, subsisting almost entirely on Martha's charity as we do. It's about time we all start to provide Excellent. for ourselves. Bears Great idea. What do you need alike. me to do? Unfortunately, we've been a little too busy of late to focus on much besides bolstering our defences. There have been alarming reports of... The horde is closing in. They're coming, so wait, all of them. Okay. Damn it all. I thought well, we'd have more time. At least we're here now. Gather the men in the square. Send to the rest for reinforcements. Yes, sir Wade. Yes, sir Wade. The horde. The horde. A cache what a name. A veritable legion of them. They've been seen prowling around the northern reaches for a while now. We don't have the numbers to hold back a swarm that size. I had hoped to build a perimeter wall so that myself and the guardians might be able to defend the village, but now you're not out had of time. chance. Yeah, precisely. Well, we will help if cut them down. The rest arrive before they do. We may just scrape through, but I fear that's rather an enormous if. Well, you've got us. What if you could call on reinforcements from Eastpool? You mean the bearers? We brought them here so they might live. I not thought die we were talking about me. For their lives. So wait. You said you lack men to defend the village. Are the bearers not men? Do they not wish to see Eastpool saved? Though they may not be trained soldiers like your guardians, what help they are able to offer could still prove the difference between victory and defeat. It is a... Uh, You're right, my lord. A chance. I will appeal to them. My friends, I humbly beg your aid. We guardians are few and our enemies many. But I swear we can defeat them with you I at our side. So. You would send us to the slaughter to serve as bait for those fiends so that you. That is not what Wade is going to do. Stand side by but side. We trusted you. Fine, okay. Do what you will. A home is not worth You can stay for. in Eastpool. 
and Wade can die, and then you guys can die. Worth fighting for. Sir Wade fights to give you lot a chance, just like I do, just like Sid does. We all wanted to give you a home where you could be free. And you got one, didn't you? This place, East Fool. This is your village, your home. If you don't fight to protect what's yours, <laughs> once again, Martha it. showing that she is best girl. You know I'm right. This world wants to take everything from you. Everything. I really wish Wade would like oh, upgrade his, his um very lives. wardrobe. So then, are you going to stand by and let that happen to you? Are you going to accept fate like good little Bran did and die having never stood up for yourselves? Or will you fight like oh. free men and women? <laughs> of course she's got the frying pan. <laughs> Well, we've got these guys. What are you doing? All right. Give me a sword. I never dreamt I'd have a home of my own. And now that I have, I don't want to lose it. I will protect what's mine or die trying. She looks young teenager like we all will free men and women fighting together for east pool i know it's the first guy is still not saying anything but he looks like he's moving with them thank you martha don't mention it just promise me one thing, that you'll show them how freeborn fight. I like, I like these two. I'm getting, they would Gladly. make a good couple vibes. Just a little bit. Well, if it was numbers you were lacking, you certainly won't be now. Yeah, I just don't I want that you. many people to die. Me? Oh, I just love the sound of my own voice. Lord Rossfield, my lady, we're ready. So what's the plan of action? We'll divide our forces into several small detachments, each made up of guardians, bearers, and guards from the rest. These will position themselves at strategic points around the village. Upon engaging with the Akashic, each detachment will keep the creatures occupied as best they can, steadily retreating all the okay. while. So you're going to lure them into the village? I am. We will have neither the time nor the resources to treat the wounded, so injuries must be avoided at all costs. Instead, we will focus purely on defense at first. By coordinating our withdrawal through the use of messengers drawn from among the bearers, we will aim to have the swarm converge at a point of our choosing. And then I Mark, handle them. Um... That point will be the village square. The perfect place for our most able warriors to surround them and fall upon them. And for you and I to finish Excellent. them off. Excellent. Plan, but one that'll require a leader with a cool head and strong nerves to coordinate the retreat. I'd say you have both in abundance to wait, but you'll be needed. Please, leave the last of the fighting no. to me. Ha! And let you have. I feel like door. Martha would be good for that section. So wait, they're here. Then you know what you must do. We work together. Everyone playing their part. Each shielding the other that no man might fall. That East Pool might live on. Hell yeah. Rosaria. For Rosaria. For Rosaria. We've no time to argue, my lord. I'll do as you ask. And I will do as you ask. I suppose we'd better do our bit too, then, eh? Right you are, Martha. Right you are.
before the storm. Hey, fellas. Here it comes. I will not let this village fall. Um, we'll see about that. Well, we're not going to see about that. I'm just thinking about best time to use. Let's use it now. Do it. Diamond does these because beautiful. Oh yeah. Over that, please. No, I have to walk around. What a stupid thing. Where is everybody? Oh no, not the check file. Get some fire up in here. bad about they're not even choke bros they're raptors but they look like choke bros so it also makes me feel bad can we climb up got them that felt easy i feel like we could have just done that all by myself but i guess it helped make the bearers more courageous like that's the last of them lord rossfield Change of plan. Oh shit, what's happened now? What is it? Owl from the rest. An Akashic curl's been sighted on Rhiannon's ride and is headed in their direction. Well, the better half of her guard is here. So wait, how many Akashic remain in East Pool? Hard to say. My men are still facing some resistance, but I think the worst okay, is behind so us. Okay, so we need to go get that. I could order a detachment or two to fall back and... No, let them finish the job. You stay here too, so wait. Your men need you. I'll go deal with I'll the, go the curl. Join me only when East Pool is won. If you're sure, my lord. May the founder protect you. Can I just No, there's no point. Um teleporting. Who were these two just stood here? Can you guys? Oh, there's a lot of people here actually. Everything I came out curls heading towards the rest. Get yourself down there. We can handle things here. Oh, I love how we had the exact same thoughts. Good luck, Wade. Good luck, Bearer. Let me summon my, my, my boy, my girl, my chocobo. Let's go. Faster. Yep, that's the plan. All right. I'll see you guys later. You guys can deal with these ones. These ones are easy. Yeah, I'm trying to get off it, please. Hello. There it is. With me.
white. Let's get in. Get some of this as well. I did not find that right. I thought I had, but I hadn't. really fast. That line. Farewell. There we go. We dealt with it. We did just fine. We did perfectly. All right. Back to East Pool. Yes, back to Eastpool. You guys did all right? Lord Rossfield, the Curl, is it? It's dead. Thank the Founder for that. And for you, my Lord. We were able to eradicate the rest of the Horde. I have guardians posted around the village to keep watch for further attacks, but all seems quiet Perfect. now. I hesitate How did to you say do? it, but I think it might be over. I think it might. We did it. We saved Eastpool. For now. Thank you, my friends. Thank you. No, Sir Wade. It's us who should be thanking you. You brought us together. Showed us what it means to fight for what you hold dear. We never had nothing to call our own before. <laughs> we didn't know what it meant to protect it. But now we do. We really do. Forgive us, Sir Wade. You and your people saved us. And still we doubted you. But there's no doubt in my mind anymore. We're free men now. <laughs> Just lady, lady nodding like in the background. Yeah. We have to fight to protect what's ours. To protect Eastpool. And we shall. We all shall. Together. Together. This is our home. And if anyone or anything tries to take it away, they'll we'll have us to answer to. Stomp them. Come on then. Let's get to work. This village isn't going to rebuild itself. Yay, there are a lot more. Not even courageous. What's what I'm looking for? Hopeful, I guess. They're not slaves anymore. No. They're Rosarians. Your father took pity on the bearer's plight. And I believe if he were still with us today, this is what he would have wanted. I believe well, you might be hope right. So. I shall remain here, my lord, and do what I can to help rebuild the village. After all, this is my home now too. And I could hardly call myself an East Poolian if I didn't pull my weight. I think you'll find it's East Pudlian, Sir Wade. Oh dear. <laughs> but you should be proud all the same. I'll have to pull my weight too. Can't have the rest getting outclassed. Speaking of which, I ought to be getting back. Can we continue to count on your support, Martha? For now. Of course. And I'd be counting on yours, too. Us Rosarians have got to stick together, haven't we? Indeed we have. And Clive, come by the Golden Stables when you get the chance. I ain't paid you for delivering them seeds oh, yet. Oh, yes. I right. quite forgot about I that. Will. Are you going to teleport me over there? Because I, this is when I would appreciate you teleporting me oh, over Rossfield. there. Do you remember our very first mission together? I do. Clearing the goblins, goblins from the still and then marshes. suddenly immobile. <laughs> How could I forget? That kept dragging me into the mud. <laughs> There's one side that I shall never forget. You, facing off against that giant mobile. Not a trace of fear on your face. Since that day, there have been more than a few times when I felt like giving up. 
when the odds seemed so stacked in the enemy's favor, I thought I may as well just lay down my sword and surrender. But every time I would think back to the look in your eyes that day and remember what it means to be a shield. Aww. Know that whatever trials Eastpool may face, I shall never lose courage. Thanks to you. Sir Wade. Sir Wade. You have always been a true shield. I know that Eastpool, and indeed all of Rosaria, will be safe in your hands. Thank you, my lord. I know the rest of the world will be safe in yours. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I'll do my best. And of course, why was that one quest like, I will teleport you over there? Nothing else does that. Oh, I need to teleport myself over here and it's just awkward. Let's go talk to my lady. And then work out where we're going next. Martha, hello. The hero returns. It's lucky you came by when you did, eh? It was. Not only did my seeds get delivered, but you went and saved Eastpool. Do I all. get a bonus for doing I that? I just did what I could. And it's only right that you get Ah, uh, that sounds like I get a bonus. Take it before I change my mind. Thank you, Martha. So, Eastpool's finally back on its feet again. Maybe not quite, home but it will be. Bearers. Who'd have thought we'd see the day, eh? Well, it was your idea. I know that, but I never stopped to think what it would mean. Bearers in charge of themselves, thinking for themselves, working for themselves. Like your hideaway, but not even hidden away. Yeah, I mean, Though I suppose the luckily. rest are much different nowadays. You know, bearers luckily, the rest like of the that. world Reminds is me going to hell, so Sid. they can't be bothered to deal with one little town. I recall that particular day. How I did take you meet it, you him? Didn't always see eye to eye. What happened? Well, if you really want to know, I started doing what I do long before I that met Sid. That seems right. In fact, that's how I met him. Or at least how he came to meet me. He showed up at the stables one day, asking questions about who'd been buying up bearers. Founder knows what he thought I was doing with them. Running a hunt, poking around in their innards. Something awful, anyway. Me, I thought he was a new constable. Thought the game was up. Oh, well, that's good but at somehow least. Somehow we both managed to work out what each other was about. Please tell me you hit him at least once with the your fine hand. It, the cheeky horse was rattling on at me about how I was doing it all wrong. After all my hard work, <sighs> told me I was giving them relief but not freedom. That my bearers were still dying as slaves. Got right under my skin, it did. Told him if he didn't like it, he could bugger off and report me to the garrison. And do you know what he did? He smiled. And then he laughed. And then I did the same. We made a pact that day. That whenever one of us was in need, the other would always be there for him. And you were. Well, we both wanted the same thing. To make life better for bearers. Just like your dad. Do you know I was born right around the time Elwyn became Archduke? Growing up, I saw how he tried to change things. He certainly didn't lack for ambition, that one. Indeed. But the loftier one's ambitions, the harder yeah, they are to achieve. Yeah, it feels like he really didn't Which is why anything. those of us who follow in their footsteps need to finish what people like Sid and my father started. Suppose you're right, I. And if we don't manage it, there's always them who come after us. Good thing we've got a few half-decent sorts waiting in the wings, eh? It's almost enough to give you a little bit of hope. Hmm. Just a little. Anyway, enough nattering. Better get back to work. Let's see about making everyone some dinner, shall we? The least the folks who saved Eastpool deserve is a hot meal. And you and me ain't gonna save the Ooh, world on an empty I stomach would neither. Not say no to a hot that meal. sounds like a wonderful idea. 
Thank you, Joe. No, Joe? <laughs> Martha. <laughs> I was just thinking about how it'd be really nice to have a hot meal with Jill. Uh, why have I got her signboard? It made sense getting Quentin's because the place is like run overrun now. But it feels like she's just taken it down from the wall and just given it to me. Is it that one that's just here? Probably. <laughs> okay. And that is it for today's episode. I hope uh, you're enjoying it. Things are certainly heating up in the game. If you did, please consider subscribing to my channel using the button on the right. And there are videos you can click on if you want to see more on the left. I will see you in the next episode. Bye.